today we are going to dive into building a toggle pricing table in Bricks Builder. Uh, this is a great way to display pricing for different payment plans on the same page. Say you want to have a monthly and a yearly payment option for your uh, app or SaaS or whatever. Um, and it's actually relatively easy to do um, with, um, there's a couple ways to do it, uh, but in this video, we are going to be using uh, Bricks Builder's content toggle element uh, to do it, okay? Um, so to accomplish this, uh, we're just gonna do it in a few in the easy steps. Um, number one, we are going to create two pricing table elements, uh, one for the monthly pricing and one for the quarterly. After that, we are going to create a new post or page that you want to put the pricing table on. And we are going to be using the content toggle element on that page. And three, lastly, we're going to insert both templates that we created in step one into the content toggle element. <laughs> so now that we went through the three steps, uh, now let's get actually get started, okay? First, um, Let's create a template for the pricing table and customize a uh, pricing table um, to fit your design specs. Um, so we're gonna edit each of the tables separately. Um, so from the header name, the price, the features, and then the call to action button, and really pretty much all elements of the design, we are going to uh, create and edit in the template. So usually what businesses and people do is uh, highlight their most popular plan by making it a different color. So we could do that by changing the table background color here. And since we are creating a darker background color, we want to change the color of the font to something that contrasts it. So let's uh, choose white as the font um, color here under typography. In the middle of this table, you can also add a ribbon with the word that says most popular on it. That's usually a uh, what people do to highlight their most popular plan also. So we just created a monthly pricing table template. So now you would need to go back to the template menu and create an inner template. Um, so for us, we would need to create a quarterly pricing table template. Um, but to make your life easier, what you could do is press this copy all button right here so that you could go create your new template and just paste this into, paste the table and all the styling into your new template and just change the pricing and change the features uh, on your pricing table. And that's how you easily create a new template and save yourself some time. After that, go back to your WordPress dashboard and add a new page or post. In this uh, video, we're gonna be adding a new page.
Then in the search bar, type config toggle and stuff like that I'll make. Now you see the default content tab added to your page. To customize it, click on the element and add its content under the content tab. So you can change the toggle name and the content type, inserting the two templates. You could also adjust the toggle style, the tab content, switch settings, label settings, and content settings. Um, Once you're satisfied with the changes, uh, don't forget to save your work, obviously, then you could preview it or publish your website to see the content how going in action. Once you are done designing, though, make sure that the table is responsive and looks good on all screens. If it doesn't look good, or it doesn't look how you want it on mobile, for instance, uh, but looks like you're on desktop, then you want to go on to the mobile mode and change the design in mobile. And there you have it. You just designed a toggle pricing table in Bricks Builder using the content toggle element.